हेलो एंड वेलकम दिस इज नंदिनी हिरानी एंड यू आर वाचिंग इट्स टुमारो न्यूज स्टॉम स्किल 10 पीपल अक्रॉस द यूएस दिस वीकेंड अ मैन वाज किल्ड बाय अ ट्री फेल्ड इन द स्टॉम्स दैट मूव्ड थ्रू ईस्ट टेक्सास इन यूएस ओवर द वीकेंड अथॉरिटीज सेड ऑन संडे नेकॉक डॉग्स काउंट्री इज वन ऑफ द मेन लोकल्स एक्सपीरियंसिंग डाउन ट्रीज स्टॉम डैमेज एंड पावर आउटेजेस फ्रॉम द डेडली सिस्टम दैट हैमर्ड मच ऑफ द ईस्टर्न हाफ ऑफ द कंट्री About 50 million people in the northeast are under wind advisories as gusts are predicted to reach 50 miles per hour or higher in some areas. Early on Sunday more than 145000 homes were without power in 8 states according to power outage US. More than half the homes were in New York, North Carolina, Pennsylvania and West Virginia. The Buffalo Niagara International Airport was among the thousands of residents was businesses in West New York to lose power according to New York State Electric and Gas spokesman. About 12000 customers were still without power on Sunday afternoon. The storms also brought damaging tornadoes to Alabama, Kentucky and Mississippi. Hundreds of thousands of customers lost power as winds whipped the trees fell. Forecasters at the National Weather Service say temperatures over much of the east coast will remain well above average even after a cold front moves through. Three people died in tornado in Pickens County, Alabama. Three deaths were reported in northwest Louisiana including two in a tornado. The governors of Mississippi and Arkansas both declared states of emergency to mobilize resources for cleanup. Several roads and highways remained closed due to high water and debris in Oklahoma, Arkansas. A school about 30 miles south of downtown Huntsville sustained major damage. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's tomorrow news Nandini Hirani. For more news updates like these, please subscribe our channel.